New at six tonight. Today, King City Police gave a first hand look at the gun mounted cameras. They're designed to assist in police shooting investigations. We were the first to bring you the story on this new technology earlier this week. Tonight, KION's Victor Guzman reports on the different ways these cameras help. The King City Police Department is the first department that will implement this technology department wide. They'll keep the police body cams for now, but say these new gun cameras provide a better perspective on whether the police are using excessive force. Step out of the car. Vernon, Texas. Gun mounted camera shows a man had pulled a shotgun on a police officer and opened fire. Both survived, but it was the camera that was key to the investigation, answering questions about how the shooting went down. These same cameras, which as of this week, will now be used by King City police officers. As you saw from the video, uh, a large concern with body cams is an officer's standard stance tends to cover the body cam. And that's a critical piece of information that a jury, quite frankly, is now demanding to see. These scenarios will continue to play out across the country, and now more than ever, it's imperative that we know what really happened. The camera's activated as soon as the officer draws his weapon from a specially designed holster. If activated, the recordings are physically stored onto a digital server by police. Adding this new technology is another tool for them to utilize to be more accountable to our community and also protect our officers. But besides police shooting investigations, these recordings can be used for training purposes too. We found that we could capture uh, deficiencies in an officer's, officer's shooting ability at the range. Uh, that are normally more a little bit more difficult to, to capture. Chief Masterson says the department hasn't had an officer-involved shooting incident in about 15 years. The new cameras will roll along with body cams and dash cams. Police say that technology was updated back in 2018. Police say the total cost to equip the 17 sworn officers of King City PD with the cameras and holsters is about $12,000. Aaron, Veronica.